Hello, everybody, and welcome, Demon Rat Seventy One Detecting. Welcome, thanks for coming in. Adventure with Goat. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody, for coming in and tell George to. Yeah, say thank you to George. Awesome, George. Yeehaw! He says, "Adventure with Goat." Good to see everybody tonight. Canadian Relic Recon, Steve in the house. John Arjun, hello, hello. So, like the title said tonight, it's an open coin chat, everybody. Let's have, uh, let's have a little bit of fun. Oh, why is my uh, webcam not working? Hold on here. Something's going on. There we go. Well, the cam's not showing anything now. Hey, Mr. Pupzilla in the house. Let's throw something down here. Look at that. Look at that one old one dollar. We'll show that off. Hey, better than seeing my old ugly mug there up there. Very cool. Chuck from Columbia, hello, how's it going? And how's everybody doing on this amazing July 12th in 2021? I'm finding, feeling a little bit better. I've had a, I had a really rough weekend. I uh, wasn't feeling too good, but uh, hey, it happens. Everybody gets sick. Not that crazy COVID stuff, but uh, hopefully not. Uh, I got my shots and all that. But John Argent, welcome. Chuck from Columbia Adventure with Goat. Dean Rack, Steve, Canadian Relic Reader, Thinking Canuck. Oh my gosh, Liz, I'm so sorry I missed you guys yesterday. I was feeling awful all weekend. And you know what? Better than uh, trying to get everybody sick, I thought, you know what? Better stay home, rest, heal up, and everything like that. David Carlyle, welcome. Thank you for coming in. That's awesome. Thank you, everybody, for coming in. You all rock. Appreciate you very much. I know there will be uh, many times in the future, Liz. That we'll be able to get together. Definitely. But good to see everybody. Dollar nine nine super chat from Canadian Relic Recon. Oh, Steve, you didn't have to do that. That's awesome. Thank you, my friend. Thank you so much. Well, I'm gonna wanna write that down. Because if we get to uh, a certain amount on the Super Chats, uh, we'll definitely be doing the giveaway. I'm going to do a giveaway anyways tonight. But see this $1 Canadian coin dollar here? Angel Weir Nursery and other things. Oh, you changed your name around. Oh, very cool. Right on. But yeah. Thank you, Steve. That's awesome. Don't have to do that, my friend. Oh, elbow cough. Oh, no. But uh, as you see here, everybody, um, I'm, I'm closing in my uh, 2K. Closing in on my 2K. And uh, this is one of the giveaways I'm going to be doing. <clears throat> oh, sorry for the sn snifflies in the mic here. I do apologize for that. I'm still getting over this head cold. With the with the weather change and everything like that, it just did me in. I do apologize. I do apologize. But um, yeah. Oh, if anybody wants to come up on the chat, let me know. And I'll pop the StreamYard link in there. Liz, you're more than welcome to. If you, only if you want. Steve, 
Canadian Relic Recon. If you want, let me know. I'll pop it in there. But yeah. Good to see everybody. Man, I wish I could have made it out this weekend. Mud Swat in the house. Coin World UK rocking it too. Hey, Coin World UK. Good to see you, Dale. That's awesome. All the Coin World UK is all the way over there in Australia. Oh, no. England. Getting everything screwed up. Already there. Uh, Canadian Relic Recon. Um, I'm going to post that in the chat there for you if you'd like to uh, come up. It's an open chat kind of night. There's no real topic going on other than did you see that 1947 Canadian video I put up with the Maple Leaf? Kevin Rose. Hello, my friend. Good to see you. It's been a while. Been a while. Wow. Good to see you. Thanks for coming up. And, uh, yeah, I, I, I was going through some of my older um, Canadian nickels, and I found some some something cool and i thought i'd share it with you so be sure to check out that video and everybody welcome please welcome canadian relic recon to the stream mr steve is in the house ladies and gentlemen thank you nick you're very welcome thank ladies you ladies and gentlemen hope everybody is having a fantastic evening oh, just, we got uh, mr john argent in the green room as well so everybody, hey, John Argent coming up here from Ontario, Canada as well, in the heart of Ontario. Hello. Actually, actually I'm in Michigan. I'm just close to Ontario. Ah, Michigan. <laughs> ah, close to Beach Metal Detecting Crate. Welcome. Thank you for coming in as well. Very good. Cool. I thought you were. Wait, oh no, I'm thinking coin coin junkie. Yeah. You guys, you guys get you confuse me all the time because you're, yeah. you're so cool. Yeah. Uh, I just collect all the Canadians, but I'm not from Canada. <laughs> that's what messes me up. I think yeah. that's what. Yeah, that's what. That's what does. I just that's picked what... this up the other day. Oh, look at that! Oh, hold on a second. Ding Nook says, I think Nick is medicated. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, oh, Again. Oh, okay. If I could just show one thing before we go any farther. Okay. Um, day quill. Cool. Yeah. 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 <laughs> uh, I, I, it's, it's still, yeah, I'm still taking day quill. So, yeah, it's, it's there. Well, I just switched to night quill before too long. So you don't stay up all night. SkyQuest to K8. Welcome. Thank you for coming in. Yeah, yeah, that's a beautiful, that's a beautiful note there. Let's just show that one more time here. All right. Get you a nice close up there. Oh, what beautiful. Oh, come on. Focus. You can do Mr. Better. Found it buried. Good to see you. So what year is that one from? Hey, George. 1923, July the 2nd, Ottawa. 1923. I have um, I have some silver certificates from 1923. Hello there, Metalitech, North Carolina. Good to see you. And we're not done yet. Oh, you got another nice one. Oh, see, he likes to tease us with all these nice little old coins. Oh, man. Yeah, nice. Nick, we really missed you yesterday, my friend. Yeah. Oh, that was, I, was, uh, I mean, you I were was, there in spirit, I know. I, I was dead in bed. <laughs> yeah. That could be a whole nother channel, dead in the bed. <laughs> yeah, let's not go there. Yeah. <laughs> that wouldn't be good. We've got 12 people watching. Thank you, everybody, for coming in. I do appreciate it. But I, I just want to... Uh, Go back over here, do that, and I'm closing in on 2K, everybody. 
1973. And I'm going to be giving That's a nice condition. This this one here is pretty crisp. So uh, part of my 2K giveaway, I don't. Um, awesome. I'm also going to give away. Um, oh, oh, it's upside down. Never. Mind. Hold on. 2020. Yep. That peace dollar to and uh, the victory. Both of them. Ooh, cool. And a silver one gram. If that comes in. But yeah. For my 2K middle to North Carolina, thank you for that awesome. uh, membership. Very nice. Thank you so much. Very good. Dime back there. <laughs> hello. Hello from Vancouver. And we're going to do uh, a few more things in there as well. Gonna keep adding to the 2K. There you go, Mud Swat. I like that idea. What's that? <laughs> what would I miss? Uh, I wish America would make a two dollar and five dollar coin so I can find the metal detecting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, but us Canucks can tell you right now, it's not that much fun when you have it loaded in your pocket, and that's just yeah. with the dollar and two dollar coins for us. Yeah. Uh, we tried one dollar coins over here, and you know they didn't go so well. And they made them, I don't know, same size as the quarter. Yeah, they're still talking about a five dollar coin for us up here. Hmm. They've been talking about that for a while. Oh, I hope not. Uh, well, I mean, for our for our hobby, it wouldn't be so bad. Yeah, but but that's about it. Yeah, Metal Detect North Carolina, you're right. They do have a much longer life. Yeah. But our money's not even paper money anymore. It's plastic. Oh, yeah, wow. Pretty, pretty much. Yep. You know, yeah. It's it's not rag. It's it's pure plastic. I know Thank because you. I had a couple of hundred That's dollars go through the there. jeans in the dryer and it crumpled it up into nothing. Uh -huh. And couldn't save it. Everybody see that queen there? Uh, That's nice. Right? 2018. 20, 2019. 19, okay. Yeah, I do need glasses. Uh, so <laughs> Liber Libertad, that is going into my 2K as well. Hey, Steel Will Queen, welcome. Thanks for coming in. Hey, Dimebag. Thank you. Chuck from Columbia, hello. How's it going? Yeah, North Carolina, I noticed. That's why it doesn't burn as well. <laughs> yeah, you, you can't burn uh, the new stuff anymore. They just, like, melt in front of you. No, the U.S. Uh, the U.S. money. Uh, Metal Detect North Carolina was saying how U.S. paper money is paper and bleach denim fabric. Yeah. It doesn't like to burn. Adventure Wood Goat, thank you for coming in. I do appreciate it. And Adventure Wood Goat, Everybody check out his channel. He's got some good content over there. And yeah, I just subbed to him. And I make much sure I didn't even know you were in Adventure there. Goat, remember what I told you. Don't let those trolls get to you. Don't worry about that stuff. Just keep going, my friend. Keep going. Yeah. That was uh <laughs> I don't want to see anybody going anywhere. Silver Shark, welcome. Thanks for coming in. Mr. Anderson, nice of you to join us tonight. A plastic finding detector. Great. That's all we need. Like, we don't find enough scrap. Yeah, plastic detector. <laughs> if, uh, you know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow if I'm feeling good? Fishing. Got to do some fishing. Oh, nice. Yeah. You just, just going up the go. river? Yep. Just uh, over there to the uh, Hall of the Marsh. And uh, mm -hmm. yeah, just throw some line nice. in for a couple hours and uh, relax. 
yeah, that water's been pretty stagnant. I drove over it today by the bridge there, by the old Oh, you marina. saw that? Okay. Yeah, oh my goodness. Yeah, she's looking pretty green. Hey, that's okay. Hey, yeah, it's, green it's, is okay. It's, it's bass season now, so hey. Lots of catfish still in that river, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, catfish is so good, too. Mm, yeah. mm -hmm. I like my catfish. Hey, I remember years ago uh, going on the north side of number nine there, and I was catching carp like they were going out of style. And uh, there were some Asian gentlemen that were uh, fishing as well. They were buying the carp off me. Oh, right on. Yeah. You know, I'm, what, 10, 8, 10 years old at the time up there with mom and dad. And to me, that was just fantastic. You know, a little bit of pocket change, paid hey. to fish. It was beautiful. Absolutely. I, I, I tried a carp years ago, just way too bony. Yeah. Oh, you got to, there, there's a special way you make carp, and I don't know what that is or, or how that is to be made. But uh, yeah, I know I my mom like caught a carp. Yeah, yeah Mike, Metal Technic Work Clan, you are absolutely right. And if anybody else wants to come up, I'm going to put the link here in the chat. And uh, yeah. This is fun. Just got these back from NGC a while ago. Which one's yeah. that? Hold on here. Let's uh, do that. This, I was not expecting this nice of grade. 1944. Yep. Nice. Very cool. That's nice. It says there's none graded higher in red brown. Oh, that's what I want to show you guys, uh, if I can find it here. I do have that posted all over Facebook, but... <sighs> yeah, that is a definite beautiful coin. A, that's a tough variety to find. 1913? Uh, the broad leaves. Yep. Right on. So, do you find those uh, coin roll hunting? Or are you are you purchasing or just? No, I purchased both of these, and for uh, I found well, I found the nineteen thirteen dime. It was in a lot of uh, fish scales I purchased, and I was like, I was just speechless for a minute. I was like, oh my god, this is worth more than the price I purchased the whole lot for. Oh wow! And I think I purchased this. 1944 for I believe it was under 40 bucks, and this the NGC list on this is 1250. Wow, because that's a slightly lower mintage year. I'll be right back. I want to find I I put a coin away that I want to show everybody. All it's right. a low mintage. Give me a, give me a second here. I'll be right back. Hold on. We'll be here. Yeah. Hope everyone's doing well today. Yeah. It was a beautiful day up here. We had a yeah. chance of rain, but ended up bypassing us. It was quite nice out. Yeah, we got all the rain here in Michigan. That's where it went. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was supposed to come this way, and it went south. But now they're talking mm -hmm. about a bunch of rain for tomorrow. Yeah. Well, so I don't think it's still not supposed to be too hot, so. No, it's supposed to be fairly nice all week long, so I'm not going to complain about that. We'll see if the rain uh, keeps me home tomorrow or not. Well, you work outside? Yeah, I'm in construction, uh, oh, okay. run equipment and drive a dump truck. So when the weather gets crappy, we tend to have to shut mm -hmm. down. But depends on the job that's going on, so I'm not sure about tomorrow yet. I know the job I'm going to, but... I'm just not sure what we're doing over there. If it's just pulling out the stone, that should be all right. <clears throat> Beach metal detecting Crete. Good night. Have yourself a fantastic evening. Wow, I recently got a 10 ounce, in uh, 10 troy ounce bar. Nice metal oh. detecting. Oh, yeah. All righty. Sorry about that. 
He, Dan Anderson, good to see you. Oh, let it in your shirt. Oh, Mr. Anderson, we need to have a discussion about uh, smoking etiquette there. Yeah. You're not supposed to burn yourself. No. <laughs> oh, I, I, I had that happen once when I used to smoke. Oh, you yeah. Flick, you flick the ash out the window, flies back, back behind you. you. Oh, God, yeah. No, that's oh, no. I, I haven't had that one yet. Oh, you oh, haven't had that happen? No. no, no, I haven't. Oh, yeah. found a bird. Georgie, 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 Georgie. How are you doing tonight, brother? So I want to show you guys uh, something here that I found when I was going through a bunch of my older nickels. Get that out of the way there. That's for the 2K. But uh, hopefully this will come in. Get that little river rock deer and see if that will come in. <coughs> there we go. Nice. <laughs> Ooh, Is that 1938? Yeah. 1938. That's nice. Mr. Uh, King George. <laughs> North <sixth>. Carolina. <laughs> it says, uh, when I applied for a construction worker job, the foreman handed me a double X t-shirt. Said, fill this out. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. That's a good one. Get get into a truck or get into a piece of equipment. Trust me, it won't take long. Oh my god. Yeah. Must be a new trend. Dan Anderson says, yeah, no new trends. We don't want new new trends. Anybody want new? No. No trends. I'd like to see a new trend. Not have to wear a mask anymore. Yes, I actually agree with that. Other than. My wife, never mind. Shh. Oh, don't do it, Nick. You're going to end up in the shed again. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's upstairs and she can't hear. You want to bet? Oh, crap. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm working. laughs> Son of a monkey's uncle. Now I bought something in the, what you see, Enterprise brought it. Another mask. Yes, yes. Mr. Doughboy356, welcome. Thank you for coming in. You rock. 15 people watching. No masks there, Mr. Doughboy. Where are you? Off to the shed and no AC. I got a fan. Who needs AC when you got a fan? Well. Brother, you have almost 2,000 fans. Almost. 15 of them are here right now. Uh -huh. I like my uh, AC about what? about zero degrees Celsius. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do like it a little chilled. Oh, you're in Maine, eh? Nice. No masks. Wow. Yeah. Well, they got no masks in Vancouver either. Yeah, I heard Vancouver, Alberta. In the States, there seems to be a lot. I've heard uh, Florida yeah. and Texas the, and now Maine. Yeah, hey, Lynn Show, welcome. Thank you for coming in. Awesome. Yeah, hey, most most states are no masks now. Oh, really? Yeah. We're eventually getting it here. Drum Detect, good to see you. Thank you for coming in, too. Look at all these new people. Hey, everybody, hit that like button, please, for me. We are going to be doing a giveaway tonight. So uh, what kind of giveaway should we do tonight? Hmm. Silver Dimes. Ozzy Alchemist, welcome. I don't wear a mask anyways. Yeah. He, he says good it. he says good morning, everybody. So he, that means Australia. Good eye. Good day, uh, yeah. eh? My wife uh Sherry oh, said that wow, I should talk, really talk like uh, Bob and Doug McKenzie, but I don't think I should. Cody Adams, <laughs> hello. No, well, speaking of giveaways, I got a few to mail out. <laughs> not take too long on that. <laughs> gold giveaway? Well, gold giveaway might be for my 2K. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Definitely. And I got I have a little bit of gold lying around. CW Weeds Weed Coins, welcome. Thank you for coming in. Ah, oh, you're Colin Whedon. I guess you changed your name. Good to good to see you, Colin Whedon. <laughs> Very cool. Right on. 
Mr. Founder Brady. Oh my gosh, George, stop it. Don't oh, do it. awesome. Thank you so much. Right on. <laughs> Nicely done, George. You know what, George? I'm sorry I haven't been able to come out, come by your streams, but sadly they're a little bit later on in the in the nighttime there, and I tend to be sawing logs by that point. Ooh, we got buffalo. I was actually talking to George about that and giving the heck. That's Don't worry. Nice yep. condition there. I did. Told him to get on there earlier. <laughs> oh wait a minute! I'm watching. I'm watching. Oh, definitely going to give away a couple of silver dimes tonight. And I hate to say it, but George, I'm giving away your silver dimes that I won off you. <laughs> Why not? Hello there, Susan Lee. Good to see you. Giveaway. Uh oh. We're not there. Let's do a few giveaways. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Good to see everybody. How many lakes we got here going? 25 likes. Very cool. Thank you, everybody. I got way too many. Ozzy Alchemist, uh, what time is it over there right now? George wants Mercs. George always wants Mercs. <laughs> I don't have any Mercs. <laughs> Dan Anderson goes, I, I dug my first 1909 Barber in seven years of detecting. What? Nice. Oh, beautiful. Duck race? I don't think we're going to do a duck race. Probably would do some guess the numbers. I think so. 99. Nice. Did I get it? No. <laughs> no, Steve. No. I think we need to find a programmer so we can turn all the ducks into like George's. We do a George race. Oh no, that would, that might not be good. No, <laughs> no, no, no. Founded buried race. Oh, Mike, is that Mike, North Carolina, or is that Mike? Okay, we got somebody lurking here in the green room. Let's see what happens when I do this. Hey, Nick, how you doing? Good, Mike. How you doing? Hey, good. that's a new. Uh, that's a new one. Yeah, that's my uh, new sticker design. I'm getting ready to oh. have it made. Oh, uh, right on. That looks great. Very cool. I'm going to make it one of the hologram ones for uh, change it oh. up a little bit. Yeah, I, I need to make some new uh, art up soon. I don't think it'll help me find much more than I'm finding now, but it's a cool sticker. Yeah. Your last video was really good, though. I, I watched that. Yeah, I found a couple little buttons in that Boy Scout neckerchief slide, but... Uh, yeah, I saw that. That's sweet. That, that, what's your? You, you said that was your second one? <clears throat> uh, I got close to a dozen of them now. Oh, it's a dozen. Wow. Is it just the area you're, you're detecting? Is that what it is? Yeah, it's a it's a park, but it's mostly wooded. And back um, before the trees grew up, it was basically a field, and uh, the Boy Scouts would camp there. You know, they'd have their little campsites there for uh, I think it was from the 1950s all the way up to the 1980s. Okay, cool. Nice. And uh, that one. The one that I found on that one, I thought it was going to be a chunk of aluminum can because that seems to be mostly what I was digging in that particular area, and then I saw that one. But when I'm in that area, I usually dig everything because, you know, the ratio of trash to treasure is, is, is pretty good. That's awesome. Right on. Oh, I just want to um, – time back, Darren Lowe, you got a sticker in mind? Hey, get her done. I know you. Uh, I know you can design can design some neat stuff there. So hey, get her done. We do it. Thirty minutes, and I want to do a giveaway. Can we do a giveaway? I want to do a giveaway. Let me uh, move some stuff around here. 
That's right. Get her done. <laughs> get that out. I just have my avatar so I can smoke and drink and not offend anyone. That's hey, that's, um, that's what I'm doing too. Other than smoking, no smoking. Yeah, no, I'm editing videos. You're, oh, I know what you're editing. Yes, I quit smoking exactly cold turkey. Now I smoke ham. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that works. Oh, I can't even see the D. Hey, at least you're not puffing on a bull. <laughs> <laughs> Stay off the pipe. Drum to the ghost. <laughs> Nick, I need your stick. Um, what? Okay, we're not going to give away that coin because I can't even see the date on it. Hold on here. I need more light. What do you got? We had 27 likes. There we go. Watching. Everybody smash that like button. Okay, this is, uh, no, I got to do something different here. Um, Nick's going to give away that rock. No one, <laughs> wants, no one wants that river rock. I actually, I got that river. that's out of my local creek. That one there. I probably. There you go. Hey, it's a sex stone. It's a sex stone. Oh. It's a freaking <laughs> rock. <laughs> this is a 1962 silver dime from Canada here. Let's see if I can get it up close a little bit more. Uh, yeah. yeah, probably not. 2021 rock. You guys let me know if that's coming in. Either way. Yeah, yeah I can see the date. Uh, that's what we're going to give away. And I'm going to... Um, there it is. Rub it. No, I don't want to rub it. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. shut up, Moose. Shut up. No it's rubbing. Like 80 sandpaper will take those scratches right off. Oh, what? 80, 80, 80, grit, 80 grit, yeah. It'll take everything off. We could, we could, we could dip it in a little bit of. Yeah, uh, I got rocks in my driveway asking 50 cents each. <laughs> One of these days, I'll destroy a coin just for all you guys and dip it in a little CLR. You know what you got to do? You got to take your oldest hammer. Dip the coin in CLR, pull the coin out, smack it with the hammer. You can give it away as a Canadian hammered coin. <laughs> there you go. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> That's, uh, yeah. Okay. Steve's well, I idea. I know you can um, do it with, uh, I think it's uh, the, the copper United States pennies. Are the ones, uh, yeah, after 82, you like file a little hole in the side and put it in the vice grips and like heat it on the stove for a minute and just flick it. All the zinc goes flying out. George goes lick it. Uh, George, I stopped <laughs> licking coins in 2019. I haven't licked a coin since 2019. So no more licking coins. You find a European coin neck here in Canada and it's gold. You're going to lick it. I might do more than that, but whatever. <laughs> I don't know any of that whatsoever. <laughs> we, we got 17 people way. watching, so hey, everybody's <laughs> got to put something in the chat because I'm I'm going to pick a number between 1 and 25. Don't don't go. don't guess this you see go. Everybody can throw that in. A 1992 penny with a hole in it. Sorry, Nick. What was the? Uh, what were the numbers that you were saying? The number ranges between one and twenty-five. One and twenty-five. All right. Only one guess each, please. And um, let me uh, let me guess a number here. Pick a number. <laughs> Not get. No. Well, hold on. I'll tell get... you what to pick. Holy moly! That's going for a lot. Wow. Susan I, Lee, thank you for joining us tonight. <coughs> All right. Everybody wait till he says go. Okay. Yep. I I have a number under that piece of paper there. You guys can't see through that, right? Okay, good. Can't don't, see the don't, paper don't, get, don't guess yet. Don't get yes until you see. There you go. go. 
All right, everybody. Good luck and go. I guess I should go on the uh, YouTube side, eh? Oh, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Well, you know what? You got to stop uh, already. Mudsaw, you, you went two digits too high, brother. Stop. Okay. Everybody stop. You know yeah, what? it was 1 to 25, brother. Um, I don't know how he did it, but uh, Cody Adams. Holy jeez, man. You must be reading my mind. <clears throat> because I, I, I never, I ever picked this number, ever. Holy jeez. Hold on here. Let me go up here. Give me one second. And... There we go. I'm going to show that right there. And then I'm going to pull that out of the way, pull this over here, this and that, and all that in between. Look. Number two. Well Number done. two. Congratulations, Cody. Guess what? You got that silver dime. Awesome. Congratulations. Congratulations. And I never guess. Uh, I never pick number two. I just thought, yeah, number two. What the heck? Right on. Congratulations, Cody. I'm going to need you to uh, email me, Cody, please. Um, can I do this? That's all right. Hey, there we go. Hey. Oh, no corn roll hunting, but uh, there's my uh, email address there, Cody. Please. Uh, Send that out. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, and others that associate themselves with trees, I'm going to bid everybody adieu. It's coming up near 9 o'clock. It's my bedtime. Yeah, Nick, thank you for having me on the stream, night. my friend. Oh, thank you for coming up. I appreciate it. Oh, it's absolutely my pleasure. And uh, we'll, we'll talk in, uh, soon. Get oh, over, absolutely your, we will. We'll get you over on the weekend, and we can... Uh, Make some Hungarian goulash on the barbecue. Oh, God. Oh, that sounds good. See you, Georgie. <laughs> and um, if I may, I'm just going to, before I leave, I am editing uh, this weekend's collaboration video. So it will be up on YouTube. Um, more than likely, depending on how work goes, probably Friday night I'll have it posted up. So if you would all like to uh, take a boo at it, it would be. Most appreciated. And I'm hey, gonna throw hey, post, up. Post your link too, eh? Post your link. Absolutely. Post your link. And thank you for coming up. I do appreciate it, my friend. Oh, and uh, yeah, we, we're gonna have to make some Hungarian goulash on the barbecue. So, oh, that uh, sounds fantastic. Uh, I'm hungry now. <laughs> and a nice slow cook with some beers off to the side and all that in between. Yeah. Now that sounds like a plan. Yep, that is. And then uh, overnight in the shed. There you go. You don't have to go anywhere. It's nice and comfy. <laughs> it's comfy out there. Trust me. Been out there many times. Well, you've been out there enough, yeah. <laughs> right on. All right, brother. Good to see you. Thank you again. Oh, my, uh, my complete pleasure. So I'm just going to throw the link up, which for some reason the computer has decided to not copy. I don't know what's going on here. 1938. And thank I think you it's old age. That. Steve, thank you again for that super chat. I really do appreciate that. Oh, my friend, please think nothing of it. it my absolute pleasure. Yeah. Okay, I'm having a moment here. Pardon me. Yes, I agree, Middletick, North Carolina. Mike, we, we got to get uh, Steve up over 100. We can uh, do it. It yeah, would be appreciated. Be I'm close. I'm close. Yeah, you, you, you get there. Need 11 more. 
Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Oh, good Lord. I got everything coming up. So there's my link. Anybody, if you wish to subscribe, it would be most appreciated. If you just want to come and view a few of the videos, by all means, please do so. If you find anything entertaining whatsoever on the channel, click the like button. Thanks, everybody. Have yourselves a and fantastic And if you don't find it entertaining, hit the like button anyway. Thank yeah, you. Exactly. Cool. Exactly. Even if you don't watch it, hit the like button. <laughs> hey, thanks, George, for putting that up there. I appreciate it, my friend. Okay, good night, everybody. Cheers, night. Nick. We'll talk during the week, I'm sure. Yes, for sure. Have a great night, Steve. Stay Take care safe, now, my friend. Bye, everybody. Hey, Cynthia, good to see you. Welcome. Thank you for coming in. <clears throat> Thank you, everybody, for coming in. I do appreciate it. We just did our first giveaway. And, um, hey, um, I really don't have much to talk about tonight, but other than uh, open chat, like, wow. anybody wants to come up and, like, shoot the stuff and just, like, share their content or their their videos that are coming up this week, uh Feel free to. And yeah, yeah it, like um, John, you you, you, I'm, you put some content out, I'm sure, right? Yeah, no, I've actually been kind of slacking lately. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Well, We've all been doing that in this nice warm weather. Yeah, Red whiskey, Texas. Good to see you. Yeah, hey, why don't I put it out here? You know, Weed stacker. Good to see you. Oh, we got lots of new channels coming in here tonight. Wow, that's yeah, awesome! Keep stacking. Oh, I need to. Yeah, I need to put out a video or two. <laughs> Get her done. All it takes is five, ten minutes. Hey, you can do it. Yeah. On that note, I'm gonna get going because I gotta be up in about a little over six hours. Well, you have a good night too, and thank you for coming in as well. No problem. I appreciate that. Very, very much. Have everyone in the chat. Have a good night. I'll see everybody later. All right. So let's see who's going. Here. And then there were two. And then there were two. I think Mr. Founded Buried will come up eventually here. He said he was going to say hello to everybody. Yeah, sure. George. I do, Mike. I do. I apologize. Eh, the last time you wanted me to come up there, and I'm, I was like, I was not feeling good, and I'm like, Oh, that's oh, okay. That's perfectly God. fine. Hey, Canadian Relic Recon's at ninety-two now. Ninety-two, right on. We need eight more. If um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the um, link in the chat here. If anybody else wants to come up. George. Um, you can also I, pin now on uh, StreamYard, I think. Yeah, I, I know that. Yeah, I know. I do know that, yeah. The giveaway, how do you enter? Well, you know what? You just have to keep typing in the chat, and um, hey, we, we'll do a number giveaway or um, a duck race or everything else like that in between. Uh, yeah. Hey. Oh, I got some uh I can give away some uh stickers and uh uh coasters and a keychain. Well, there you go. Absolutely. Thank you, Mike. I appreciate that. Yeah. And um yeah, I got to get some more stickers myself. I'm I have yours, Mike, and I have George's and I've got a few other people. I need some new stickers coming in. Hey, if anybody has a sticker they want to send to the uh, into the stream, let me know. Send me an email, and um, hey, I do shout outs and all that kind of stuff. And actually, that's something I wanted to do tonight as well that I just remembered. Oh my goodness. Demon Rat 71 Detective, thank you for coming in. Yeah, get that lawn done. Make it nice and straight lines. I actually... Uh, let's 
do a little mail call here. Hold on. Uh, let me move this out of the way. Hold on. Steel Wool Queen, that's okay. Hey. When you participate in streams and get in and help back and everything like that, hey, we understand and that's uh it's amazing what you do. All these moderators that uh, donate their time out here and everything like that is amazing. You guys got to check this out. I I got this uh, envelope here. Got some mail from uh, Lisa Przaski. If I'm saying her name right, I do apologize if I if I haven't. But uh, check this. Uh, this is cool. Oh, let me uh, get this up here and over here and check that. That this is, this is cool. Free ticket. Not good for anything, just free. And she sent me a little note here. She goes, Nick, just a quick hello and say congratulations on getting monetized. I got some of those too. Those are cool. <laughs> and those are awesome. Your, yeah, that's isn't that cool? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Keep up the great job with your videos, count and everything. And uh, I gave one to my boss at work. I said, here's a free ticket. He looked at it and started laughing, put it in his pocket and walked away. <laughs> she sent me this really cool note and everything here. And I want to thank her very much for sending that. I, um, I, I'm going to give one of these to my wife to see what happens. So wish me luck. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that cool? That's awesome. That is awesome. You know, what, I should get. I'm. You know, what, I'm going to give one of those away tonight because I got a few of them. Yeah. So hey, that'll be. We'll add that to another giveaway tonight later. <coughs> Weed stacker, hello, Lynn. Show and thank you everybody for coming in. That's awesome. I think our air conditioning is off because the house is heating up. It's a, it's been warm here tonight. Oh my goodness! Got to uh, like a eighty five degrees today. It got up to I think uh, ninety one, and then a pop up thunderstorm rolled through and just made it more humid and miserable. Oh no! The temperature didn't drop; it just got wet, and then it just the sun came back out, and uh, it just got humid. So That's I was going to go detecting after work, and then, you know, you just step outside, and you just, just start sweating. That was us. Um, that's going to be us tomorrow. Uh, we're supposed to get, like, rain all week long, and, oh, it's just going to be hot and humid and rain. So that should be, that should make things interesting, but, uh We've got 12 people left watching here. I guess somebody else came on. It's more interesting. Still we only there. need eight more subscribers for Canadian Relic Recon to get them to 100. Eight we more? We can do it tonight. If you haven't picked them up, go ahead and pick them up now. I want to pick another dime to give away here that I can actually see the date on. Ellen W says George wants to do a duck race and he wants to wear a bikini later. What was that word? Uh, what? Bing, Bing Kanga, Bing. <laughs> Thought I said bikini. Bing Kino. <laughs> This is going to be a 1964 giveaway. On the top of the hour, give or take. Hey, George, you still listening? Wake up. Wake up, George. Son of a... Thunder pups. <laughs> Sons of a monkey's uncle. 
Son of a beehive. Son of a beehive? Mm. Honey? Honey, anybody? Honey? Hello there, SkyQuest 2K8. Welcome. Thank you for coming in. That's awesome. Yeah, buddy. He goes... I was George. watching this video about this guy clearing a uh, bald-faced hornet's nest. You know how nasty those things can get? And he sit there and he put this, you know, like, cause they, um, <laughs> he starts, he put like a plastic sheet over the, the nest. Like he, uh, thinks he knows what he's doing. And then he starts spraying the inside of it with like a smoke and half of them got out and just attacked the hell out of them. And he didn't have any, um, bee suit on. Oh shit! And he got all messed up. <laughs> oh, I bet he did. Because those bald-faced hornets don't play. There you go, George. If you want to uh, come up there, if anybody else wants to come up too, yeah, George, you gonna wear your bikini? Isn't that the game? I'm gonna I'm gonna let Mike hold down the fort for like uh, three minutes. All so, right. Uh, hey, you don't you don't mind, do you? No, not no. at all. Okay, thank you, sir. I, I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I just... Uh, Sticker Mule is running a special. You know, you get those... Uh, if you do anything with uh, Sticker Mule, they send you special uh, notifications. And uh, you can get uh, 10 keychains for a really cheap price. So I went ahead and got 20 keychains made. And so now I got 20 keychains to give away. I, I already gave away a couple of them. But uh, so now I got stickers, coasters, and keychains. So I'm going to include that in one of these giveaways that Nick's having tonight. When uh, after probably right after his dime one. So, and if you're not in the United States, I can still ship it to you. So come on up. Found it buried, George. Hello, angels. We are nursery. Good to see you. You're back. Yes, we missed you. Yeah, there's a uh, yeah. yes, an we actual, an actual Boy Scout, Scout camp, camp nearby. Camp nearby. Yeah, there's a, uh, there's a actually, 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 she oh, tried to steal. No, no. Tried to steal the bone off Boris, and Boris kind of lost his mind and tried to kill her. I think. <laughs> yeah, we got some yeah, echo going here. here. <laughs> oh man. Um, Poor Envy. Another new media. We got Patrick. Come on, hello, Patrick. Hey, hey Patrick. No, I oh, no, I I Not that one. Not that one. Mr. Patrick. Hey, 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 hey. All right. If I lose connection, man, it's because I'm trying to. I don't know if I can. I don't even know how I made it up here. <laughs> Canadian Relic Recounts at 95. Oh, I gotta get him to 100. So I'm gonna grab his link again. Canadian. What's going on, Nimbus? How, 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 how you doing? Getting parcels Getting ready parcels to go over to the United, United States. States. It's the first time I've, first ever, time sent I've ever sent it. Uh, they uh, packaged the package. Yes. It's cheaper. It's cheaper. It's cheaper. It's faster. It's cheaper? It's cheaper. It's cheaper. It's cheaper. Really? I think we're getting, right. we're getting feedback here for somebody. Here for somebody. It might be. <laughs> I don't know if it's me. You see, there's a big difference between cheap and inexpensive. Is it me? I think so. I think so. Let me, let me, uh, I'm going to mute you for a second. Hello? 
testing one two three yeah definitely george all right george <laughs> you're you're echoing there um echo echo it could be because you got yeah you got two multiple windows of i'm not sure what's going on okay i'll unmute you to see what we got we can do oh he he left to fix it welcome the news maniac yeah i'm kind of excited the guy that i'm sending this out to he uh he's overly generous and i feel guilty when i get the stuff because uh, i i nearly completed my u.s penny collection in one day wow in, with in this guy. One day. like boom done nice like, really so i i'm sending him out uh, some significant items so he's going to get a really nice nice treat when it uh arrives next week oh very cool but yeah other than that just just uh had a couple sick days for the first time in a year and a half oh that was me this weekend oh my god i was supposed to go out digging with uh digging canuck and um yeah steve shepherd and um canadian the relic recon and uh, i was just like oh my god i was just I was feeling like crap. I had the hot and cold chills and everything else in between. Me too. I, I like, call it the hacking back oh. because every time I hack, my back went out. Oh, so, yeah. Oh, you had that too. Oh. sitting there. I was, was going to go out metal detecting myself. It was supposed to be a big, huge collab. And I'm like, oh my God. This is, it's okay. George found it buried. It's okay. Nick, there's sometimes you just got to suck it up, Buttercup. Yeah. Oh, not this time. I was in. I, I've been. I was in bed for two days straight, sucking back uh, day quill and a little bit of night quill and everything else in between. It was not good. <laughs> hey, well. we've had all this wet rain and then warm and cold, warm and cold, and you know what? It just caught up with me. I never caught a thing until I went out the first time without my damn mask on. And I went, my, my son took me out to a, a dinner theater, which was absolutely beautiful. And uh, a woman in front of us was hacking her brains out. Oh, no. And so what the hell are you doing in here? And sure enough, the next day I was down for the count for, for a day and a half. Damn. You're going to find, that's, that's all I need. I'm feeling better now, but. Oh, that's you know, good. Yeah. I'm, wa I'm wanting to get out. I'm. That's why you carry a can of Lysol with you, and when she starts hacking and gacking, you just spray her down with a can of Lysol. Oh, oh, oh! You <laughs> just gave me a flashback. Oh my gosh, my my my! When this whole thing first started, and, and the whole issue with China and everything, a young fella comes up to our door, and he was he was uh, doing a door to door salesman, and he just happened to be Oriental. My wife took one look at him with the can of Lysol and chased him out of our yard. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Hey, Marty's nuts about digging in coins. Welcome, my friend. Good to see you. Over there in uh, Nova Scotia, I do believe. New Scotland. Nova Scotland. New Scotland. You gotta look you gotta look everybody in this chat here. You got everybody around the world. Look at this. Ozzy, David. <coughs> We got Aussies in there. I gotta take a look at this. Like, there, 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 there's people, Cody, and like there, there's people everywhere. It's truly a worldwide community. I love it. Very cool. Oh, that's what's wonderful about our community. Hey, Ashley Westcote. Good to see you. And Angels is in uh, New Brunswick. New Hi, Brunswick. Angel, how you doing? California for SkyQuest. Nice. Angels, are. what part of New Brunswick are you from? I lived in West St. John at one. Actually, I lived in East St. John, too. But uh, my fondest memory is West St. John overlooking the Reversing Falls Bridge. North Carolina. Co Cody Adams, you're, you're in North Carolina?
I just Where's switched. Go? You still hear me, Nick? I do. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah. If you if I you don't hear me, I'm just reading the chat here. Catching I'd love up. to get down to North Carolina and through all through, all through the states. It's high time. Let's see. Honey, I want to win a bagel. I want to travel the whole U.S. of A. And she goes, I'm not <laughs> and traveling right. in no, she calls it a coffin on wheels. I'm not traveling in a coffin on wheels. Well, there's the coffin on wheels, and then there's the one that you tow, which is called the big wobble box. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Come on, I drove, I drove city bus and trolleys and all that stuff for years. I, I can drive a Winnebago. Let's see what Canadian Relic Recon is up to now. It was at 95. He is now at 95. He's still at 95. Yeah, SkyQuest. I can't help how my wife feels. She's from a British family, and, and they have hardcore feelings about it. And uh, oh, there's no Peter change. Both. I'm not that way, but uh, that's the way it is. Hello, Peter Bros. Welcome. Thank you for coming in. I do appreciate you, my friend. He's from uh, Canada as well, everybody. What What is uh, Canadian Relic Recon on? He is on 95 subscribers right now. 95. He needs you're, five you're, more. You're, you're blue, right, Mike? No, I'm green. Uh, oh, oh. I. Uh, Oh, you're green. Well, thank you very much, sir. Again. <laughs> um, I get. I guess I can make you green, and you can. Uh, I mean, blue. It can still post, right? I'm not sure how that works. I've seen George do that, but I don't know how that works. Hmm. Oh, green. Let me try. I can try. Um, but I don't think so. Mutz, what? Um, he, he, can you can you post uh, Canadian Relic Recon's channel in the chat? Um, okay, I just it, sent it, but I don't know if it's showing up. Well, you know what? I can I can if it comes up, I can override it myself, right? So okay. Um, oh, David Carly, I'll put it there. Oh, look who's coming up here. All the way from Vancouver, Ontario, Canada, British yeah. Columbia. We have Mr. Dime back there coming into the house. What's up, eh? Unbelievable. Good day, eh? Take off your hoser. <laughs> What's up, hoser? You don't know what you're talking about. There you go. just okay. said Vancouver, Ontario, Canada again. I did. He did. <laughs> I, I do that all the time. You know why that is? That's because everybody in Ontario thinks the world revolves around them. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah, probably right. Yes. Vancouver, Ontario, Canada. Vancouver, ah. Canada. Mm -hmm. You know how many times I've said that? Always. British Columbia, Canada. Canada. A Vancouver area. The coming GVRD. in live. Coming Greater in Vancouver live. Regional it's only like 6, 6 p.m. over there. I'm jealous for that, is it? by the way. Yeah. Oh, geez, it is. Geez, look at that. It's dinner time. What are you doing it's, online? It's swimming what? time, actually. What, why are you not eating? Hey. What? I'm going to have to be there by half past. Damn. I had Burger. such a problem with the system here because uh, there was a Windows update and it messed everything up. But the swimming pool starts at 6 and goes till 8. So I will leave here soon and go swimming. But I'll take you guys with me. No, please don't. No, I always do. You no. don't know it. Oh, don't do it. No. Canadian Relic Recon's got an indoor, uh, outdoor pool that's in ground. Might have to go visit him. I lived on McKeel Street there, Anna. Ozzy Alchemist, Alchemist got a question here. Does that fun coin show go to Canada as well or USA? Uh, the coin shows tend to be separate <coughs> can't, can't from, from the US, but 
occasionally a, a dealer will come up from the states uh not not to belittle toronto but edmonton alberta has the largest coin show in canada every year twice a year yeah I'm gonna make it we, we have coin shows over here but um oh you have some pretty good ones actually but it's just not as big as you guys though so. oh it's 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 absolutely huge yeah we have some big huge uh like sports cards and comic book shows but uh that's about it hopefully this year we'll have some because i'm looking forward to it well i, I see actually... nick's on the back on the bridge of the enterprise the enterprise what does the Starship Enterprise and the toilet paper have in common? Okay, go ahead. I'll bite. I don't know. They both circle Uranus and they both wipe out Klingons. <laughs> I like it. I love it. That's cool. Yeah. That's, that's <laughs> that's cool. New green. That's, that, that's a good one. That is a good one. I love it. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah, that's cool. I love it, Mike. That was right out of the third grade handbook. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I better not tell any jokes on here. Yeah, I'm. I, I still got a nice yellow monetized button going on, so that's good. Yeah, keep all your bad dad jokes in your database. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, I like that. That's a good one. Do you mind if I use it? No, go ahead. <laughs> oh, too funny, too funny. What, what do we got here? Um, 12 people watching. That's it. What? what? Get the stream out, everybody. I want to do one. I, I got to do at least one more giveaway here. Another get giveaway, another uh, silver dime, and. Um, this nickel you see there, we're gonna give away that too. The forty-five. Oh, we got. Oh, we got, I. I don't want to say who's online right now. So yeah, that's where everybody's heading out and going to. Don't online do or it. Online. Don't do it. Come back. <laughs> Just a little bit. I really, I really don't need to watch time, but I would like to watch time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. I've, I haven't been on in like three weeks because my daughter. I, okay, disclaimer right now, everybody. Why I haven't been on in a few weeks? My daughter wanted to do summer school for extra credit for English. So, what did she take? University English. Oh boy. Why? She's only 16. Smart? Uh, yeah, she's very smart. She's getting 90 in the course so far. So, um, you know, when I was you... in high school, I went to summer school between 9th and 10th grade and between 10th and 11th grade. And I took, you know, some classes on each. And when I got to my 12th grade, I only had to go to school for half a day. So at lunchtime, I was out of there. <laughs> I, I I never took summer school, but um, yeah. People look at you like, "Hey, you you failed something. Why are you having summer school for?" I'm just, I'm just trying to get plan ahead, so I. Can... <laughs> well, Don't that's what she's bad. doing. She she wants to become a a vet veterinarian. Oh, that's an extra eight years in in university as well. Does your does that does her school have a co op program where she can get a job uh, through the school at a vet, where the school will help her uh, get hired at a vet, kind of like an intern? You know what? Uh, that's a good question, and that's something I should look into. Actually, I'm not sure, but uh, yeah, no, but she that's what she wants to do, eh? She's gonna kill me. <laughs> You know, I went back. To, sorry, I went back to school when I turned forty, after I retired from the service. 
and one of my classes was a uh, social studies 30 and the book i picked up i looked at it and i said okay interesting start i leaf through it realized that a whole bunch of the stuff that was in there was stuff i lived through so i showed up for one class for the whole semester read the book like it was a tech uh, a regular book you know not, nothing big and then i challenged the course at the end and passed nice i'm right on way to do it it's like i've been teaching electronics for you know i've been in electronics for pretty much most of my adult life and then uh a couple of years ago i took uh electrical systems engineering at a community college and it was a joke you know i graduated with a 4.0 nice right on mike i was like you know this is <laughs> where's the challenge here <laughs> I wish I could have finished college, but um, I kind of fell down a flight of stairs and bent my knee back the wrong way. Ouch. And uh, yeah, that was the end of my law enforcement career. I wanted oh, you to be, were uh, law enforcement? Yeah, I wanted to become a forensic photographer. Oh, really? But you You had to go through police college first. To be so you could carry a gun and all that crap. I never wanted a gun, I just wanted my camera. But you had to go through the course in my fourth year. I went down a flight of stairs with, with a 40 pound backpack on in the winter time, Seneca College in Ontario, Canada, and that was it. Poof, lucky you didn't break your neck. Um. Yeah, but I folded my, my my you know how your knee bends backwards? Yes. Not forward? It's not not well, yeah. Oh, it, it all oh, everything bent the wrong way and oh my god. Tear your meniscus in your AC, ACL? I oh, I tore it. everything. I my knees all rebuilt. I actually need to get it replaced, but um uh no, not yet. I'm not ready for that crap, but uh Oh, yeah. It was bad. 13 months of recovery. Ouch. Mm -hmm. So you're walking around like an Imperial Walker. <laughs> uh, yeah, pretty much and still to this day. And as we get older, uh, I'm, I'm walking with a cane now. Cane, metal detecting, and everything else in between. So. <laughs> When I'm metal detecting and my back starts bothering me, I use my shovel as kind of a cane. <laughs> I did that. I actually did that not too long ago. <laughs> That's funny you said that. That's very funny. I, I did that. Oh, my gosh. If I, if I wasn't so sick this weekend, I would have been, I would have been out in the fields there doing that with my cane and metal, metal detecting with Liz, Dick and Kanaka, and CJ, and Steve, and Steve. Yeah. That would have been a, that would have been a great one, you know, a great time. Yeah. I'm well, sure boys, I would have made a much earlier appearance if I could get the equipment running right earlier, but it took a little bit. Now I really want to go swimming, so I'm going to bow out. I wanted to give you some watch time, and of course, congratulate you on getting the channel where it needed to be, buddy. Good, Thank good you, on you. Sir. Thank you, Dad. Happy to be one of the early early sponsors. Yes, you were. Yes, you were. Now, I, I think you're the first one that, uh, well, the first three to give me a super chat, which is awesome. Thank you so much. I definitely wasn't the first one. I remember that was not me, which, you know, uh, you, you shoot for that. It wasn't George either, though, was it? Oh, no. Wait a minute. Uh, what's that? I have to go you back. You got to remember who that is. Yeah, that's a milestone there. That is, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anyway, Thank you. Always, always Thank good to see you there. I'll be looking around to see who's on at about 8 o'clock when I get home. And until then, 10-4. 10-4. post your link there, Darren. Hey, everybody. All we give for the nose where I'm at. I got to go. Check Darren out, too, everybody. We, and we got to get Steve Relic Canadian Recon to at least. What's he at right now? 97. 97, okay. Oh, yeah. Coin World UK was the first, and Found It Buried was the second. Oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> Dale. That right on. Very cool. Dale's a great guy. That he is, and I pre appreciate effort. You know, 
not just the super chats or the the memberships. I appreciate everybody. You know what? You guys have made this community so amazing. You know what? And um, just going to keep going forward and uh, doing more giveaways and helping everybody else out as well, right? So, hey, we got to do it. Hey, Patrick. Yeah. I've been waiting for more of your videos, and you, I don't, I haven't seen much out for like. You your... know what? You 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 beat me up with a wet noodle. I, I'm uh, my, I'm having trouble. <laughs> I'm having a lot of trouble with my with my program. I've got a I got a backlog of videos that, that I want to send up, but uh, what happens is when I try to upload it, it doesn't upload all the uh, pictures and pictures and the music and every all my. All my uh, written stuff, it, it it just ends up the plain video. Okay. And uh, you know, I I'm, I I got a pretty steep le learning curve here. I mean, I need I need a student that's versed in this modern. You know, come on, I'm I'm just above rotary dial here. So I would really <laughs> no, you're like not. To get, no, you're not. No, I'd like to get somebody that to sit down with me, not a video on YouTube because I'm sitting there and nine times out of ten. With the accents, these guys—they're all smart, but they're, they're, they seem to all be from different countries, and I can't understand a word they're saying. I'm just like, ah, so and slow down. So you know what you need to do? Go with a simple program like Filmora. Like what? Filmora, Wondershare. Filmora. Filmora. Does that work with? Uh, does that work with uh, Apple? It should. Yeah, um, I've never heard of it. Yeah, no, it's, it, it's what I use for all my videos. I've been doing that for two years with my really? videos. Go just go to, yeah, go to their website and they should have a download for uh, Mac OS or Apple yeah. or uh, whatever platform you use. Filmora. You can get the free version of it or um, you can pay for it. You know, it, it's only a hundred bucks. For the program well i'll try the, i'll try the free version first see if i like it and if i do yeah like it, then I'll, definitely then I'll um i wish there was like uh an affiliate link <laughs> that'd, be, <laughs> that'd be sweet yeah wouldn't it though i would have to i might have to reach out to them and say hey need an affiliate link hey let me know yeah, it, you know it's, it's an amazing program and I, i'm i'm using version 8.2 seven one or whatever it is and they're already at version 10 i'm going to be upgrading to it the uh, new version soon but um but yeah, yeah it, it, it's something that would work i post a video every day i mean i'm retired the, like hello the, yeah there you go the program is it's not that hard hey and if you need help with it um i can be your tech support hello Oh, you know, volunteering. I like volunteers. I will volunteer and help you out. Absolutely. The program, the pro you can you can do voiceovers, which I do a lot of. You can put music behind. You can there's so much you can do. It's amazing what you can do with that program. Yes, is, is I'm, that what George uses? Because he's gotten to the point now where his his videos are almost psychedelic. No, I mean, he's no. got lots of stuff on there. Holy cow! I know founder Barry George has used that in the past, but I'm not sure what he's using right now. But um, you know what? Uh, you can do just about anything you want. Oh, David, it's uh, as a as a cre content creator, uh, we have to use editors to uh, to uh, fix up our our content, so it's you know looks a little more professional, has an intro and outro. And you can add certain things uh, for content uh, to make it uh, more feasible to watch. Oh, absolutely! Right, I, I'm actually working on a video right now for my memberships for my channel because I'm getting monetized. I I can uh, put out uh, those kind of videos, right? And um, I'm working on something like something crazy, but uh, not too crazy, but. Doing it all with Filmora, and uh, you know what? With a couple different programs, Filmora and like a paint program, it's amazing what you can do. Yeah, I want to get ready for Christmas. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. okay. 
you know, we're talking four months straight every day. Right on. That's cool. You'll have fun with that. Oh, I love it. Yeah. Bring it on. And if anybody wants to become a member, you can use cool emojis like cool that. emojis. Cool Only if you want. Emojis. Helps me out with my channel, and I, do, and I do appreciate it very much. And thank you again, Mike. That's awesome. And now I can create another emoji for the, the channel because that every time you get a new member, um, you can create more emojis for it. Cool. Yeah. Katie and Relic Recon is at 97 subscribers. Okay. Um, we got to get them to 100 tonight. We have to get them to 100. It's only three more. Yeah. Oh, there you go, uh, Patrick. Uh, George put something in the chat there. Renderforest.com. Mm hmm. Yeah, we 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 gotta get them to a hundred. Um, if I turn cool. you blue, Mike. Uh, Thank you very much. Will that make you ungreen, or I I don't know how that works. It will make me blue, and then the but that little S for a. Uh, Right. We'll still be there. We'll still be there. Okay. Yeah. All right. That way you can post your link there too as well. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. I just got done bookmarking that link that uh, George sent. Thanks, SkyQuest. Appreciate it. Ooh. I'm going to do the same too and check that out later on. Yeah, I just right-click it and open in a new tab and then... Uh, yeah. Add bookmark, and there we yeah. go. There you go. Uh, thank you, George, for posting that link. Yep. Once he gets to 100 likes, too, he can change his name there. That's his last name. <laughs> That's a Hungarian last name. He's a Hungarian brother. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. This is not good. Not good. So if the Olympics are, are done in Hungary, are they Holy the Hungarian games? Crap. BC Treasure Tales. What, Jason? What are you doing? Oh, my God. Hasten, Jason, Perry, Mason. Wow. Bada boom. Bada boom, bada bing. Thank you so much, my friend. Thank you so much. You didn't have to do that. Oh, my God. Wow. That is amazing. Wow. Thank you, Jason. So I, wow. So I think, Nick, this weekend I'm going to hit some garage sales and I'm going to go out and do some metal detecting. Garage sales and metal detecting? Nice. Oh. Well, we, we've waited for a year and a half, so they've got to have some good stuff. Oh, more than like. Oh, definitely. Hey. Be sure to uh, find anything good. Take a video. Yeah, and you want to hear something wild? My local, the one of the largest local coin stores in Western Ontario, uh, Western Ontario, Western Canada, cannot is is turning people away who are trying to sell their collections because there's too many people selling. Oh, because they, they can't afford it. Yeah. They, they just they just said no. We we've got enough. We got too much. I wow. Know. Okay, so I've got a feeling that's going to be a buyer's market pretty soon. Well, it happens when there's too much coming in and not enough going out. Yeah. Well, if, the, not, if until, those, not until the economy stabilizes. But if those dealers go on the internet, there's a there's a big huge market for everything. So. Yeah, maybe I'll be able to afford my 1947 silver dollars that are outrageous. Oh, you want you need one of those, uh, yeah. No, I need three of them. I need a, a pointed, a blunt, and a maple leaf. That's about three thousand dollars for the three. Wow. And then oh, you've got uh, the nineteen forty-eight, which is the last one I would need. 
and that's roughly a thousand dollars dang so but then i'm done I, i've got all my my canadian silver dollars that's good yeah just trying to figure out a way that my wife doesn't find out <laughs> no. no. What happens yeah, in the, the shed? You, the the alarms shed. will go off. The alarms Wait will go off. Unauthorized purchase without spousal approval. Uh, yeah, yeah. You got to make sure you have a shed. Where I, uh, I do. Uh, hey, buddy. I have. Well, it's not a shed. This is my shed. You know that. This is yeah, my I shed know. in here. I, you know. I know. Yeah. That's my shed. See, there nice. I am up there. Yeah. Like this is my room. She Gee, we guard in the park good to see it. Yeah. Uh, he that's his man cave. That's a man cave right there. Look at that. Yeah. That's to, that's totally a man cave. Weird bar, weird guy in the park. Welcome. Thank you for coming hey. in. Very cool. Hi, lightning. Good to see you. Thank you very see? much. I don't have a Morris, but I got a lightning. There you go. Hey, buddy. We got, we got 38 likes, everybody. Like if we can get to 40, oh, that'd be awesome. Outside. Mistake. Budget bullying stacker. Good to see us regulated into the shed. Yes, there you the go. man cave is there. Give me a second, everybody. I got to get myself a Diet Coke. Hold on a second. Yep, and I got to close the door. Can't let the mosquitoes in. Mosquitoes. Wolf spiders are the worst. I had a little hole in the screen, and the bugs were coming in, and I was like, what? Where are all these mosquitoes coming from? I saw a little hole in the screen. I was like, oh, man. Yeah, we're trying to get Canadian Relic Recon to 100 subscribers tonight. We got three to go. And here's the link. George! see what's this one I don't know what that is it's a red splotch I need to put on my glasses or something everybody went quiet can anybody still hear me <laughs> uh, let me see what we can do here. There's 14 watching. We had some new people come in tonight. So if you're not aware, we're trying to get uh, Canadian Relic Recon to 100 subscribers tonight. And he's at 97 right now. I just posted the link. Ooh, he just reached 100. He got to 100. Awesome. 100. Nice. Right he on. He got to 100. 100 even. Awesome. Very cool. Right on. Well, we, we got to get some gravy on that, eh? There you go. A little we buffer zone. Some, keep him up there. Yeah. So, but we're, we're going to do it. We, I mean, he's only got a few videos, but he's, you know, he's. It's tough, you know, starting out. You know, I know. <laughs> the He's going to get some up there. hard to get. Okay, let's let's do a giveaway. We got. Let's uh, do that. A big twenty dollars super chat there from BC Retro. And yeah, yeah. Just we here. So, um, hmm. Let's see. We'll just do a number. Give Ramon one. Welcome. Thank you for coming in. Ramon, how you doing? Just some time for a giveaway. We got a big, huge twenty dollars super dot there from PC Treasure Trails. Jason over there in uh, Vancouver, Canada. 
PC. See, I didn't screw it up this time, Darren. We'll give away this 1945. This. What year is this again? This is a 1954 silver dime. Let's see if I can get this up here. Cool looking uh, free ticket from uh, Lisa P. We'll add that in the giveaway. And um, we'll give away a, a few stickers and postcards as well, as always. So let's uh, let's pick a, do a number of giveaway. Mm -hmm. What do you think? We got 16 people here. Um, where'd, my, <laughs> where'd my pen go? Oh, five dollar. What? I'll root the month. And maybe a, awesome. another nice right on found it buried. Thank you, George. I guess we're doing like a, a, a found it buried stream where he does every twenty dollars for um, <laughs> for um every twenty dollars we're gonna do a giveaway. He's <laughs> just doing to you what we do to him. Yeah, no kidding. I did that to him for a while. <laughs> All right. Anyways, um, fifty. Okay, we'll, we'll do it like a a one uh, and uh, hmm. Okay, I need I need to pick a number here that nobody can like guess right away. Hmm. How about that number that belongs between six and seven? <laughs> what are you talking about, Willis? <laughs> you said a number nobody knows. Yeah. Nobody knows the trouble I've had. <laughs> um, all right. I got a number here. Oh, nobody can read it. Oh, okay. Don't put anything in the chat, everybody. Um, Okay, let me write this down here. I'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. When you see my go over, buddy. Before, before I wait, do this, it's the number range is between one and 30. And switch Beyond. to live chat. Exactly. I was just about to say that. Yep. Mike's on the ball. Be a live chat. And um, when you... 66666. What? What? Well, uh, Ramon won. I, I might just send you so, some postcards for just that one. <laughs> just for the heck of it. Because I got some new ones. Anyways, everybody... One to thirty. Wait for my go, and uh, good luck to everybody. <laughs> George and me picked the same number. <laughs> I saw that. That I threw that. Yeah. Oh, son of a bitch! The sons of my monkeys, Uncle. Yeah, the, you guys could do multiple guesses this time. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> I didn't say one guess, so. I'm going to go up to the top here and take a look. Um... Oh, stop. Stop, 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 stop. Stop. We, we have a... Winner, I'm gonna skip, yeah. put stop in there, everybody. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Well, this man has read my mind so many times. 
And uh, I'm. I won with seven hundred sixty-five thousand eight hundred forty-two. Mm, no. No. Oh, dang, damn it. <laughs> no. Um, I, I just I got to go up here and um, on the streamer side so I can show it. Hold on here. The first person that showed it guessed the correct number. Okay. This person has won multiple times my channel. And that's okay because, hey, good for them, right? Right. But uh, Mud Swat, <laughs> you got it again, brother. Yeah, got it again. Wow. Holy shnikes. That's amazing. I love it. <laughs> there you go. Uh, yes, you can give it to somebody else if you want. Absolutely. But it's going to be for the 45 and the silver dime as well. Um, if you want to gift it to somebody, you absolutely can. Yes, you can. That Oh, the number was 18. Um, did it show up there? No, I'll tell 18. you what, why you won't walk away empty-handed. If you email me your info, I'll send you some stuff, some coasters and stickers and a keychain. You want to send it to Goat? Who's um, Goat? Um, I remember saying Goat on. What was his hand, whole handle? Hold on here. Um, it's just trying to um, hold on here. Um, Let's see if I can look it up. So, BC Treasure Shells, you want you want to send that to uh, Adventures with uh, Goat? Adventures with Goat. That sounds about Adventures, right. That's okay. That's right. Yeah. So I'm going to have to. He wants to uh, give it to David Carlisle. Oh no, hold on. no, that's it's, found it buried. George. George is George is George okay. No, Mud, Mud, yeah, he wants Mudswat says, "Give it to David Carlisle, please." Okay, that I will do. Mudswat, that's awesome. Nice. So David, Car David. David Carlyle, I will be sending those out to you. And I'm going to send that free ticket out to him as well. I feel like that. That was part of that giveaway. Explain to me this free ticket. Well, this free ticket that got sent to me was from uh, Lisa Przoski and she's from um, Michigan and she sent a whole bunch of these out to everybody and um, yeah just something fun for her to do to give back to the community hmm. which is really cool so there you go David Carlisle I have your information on my database that I've saved up because you said to keep your info for a future and I did. That's awesome. That's what very cool. And I think uh David Carla, you, you got my stickers and my uh postcards. So I'm gonna try to find something else to send to you as well. Well anybody who wants one of my stickers, I always send a coin with it. Oh, I can send one of yours, uh, Patrick. Oh, yeah, Absolutely. you should have extra. Okay. I, I do. I have some extra, yeah. I've been giving a lot away, so. Well, that's what they're there for. Exactly. Absolutely. Yep. Um, yeah. Everybody should turn over a new leaf. Let me put that down here. Throw one of those up there just so everybody can see. <coughs> I 
I will good. send you some um, interesting, interesting postcards that I have that um, probably nobody has ever seen because they're deemed more for my town and stuff like that. Well, I've yeah. got a couple of your cards. Well, that's right, yeah. Yeah, George has been streaming a bunch of nights uh, there, Ramon. Some late night streams. Yeah. Too late night, George. Twelve thirty, one o'clock in the morning. Yeah, he's turning into a night worker. Yeah. That's what my daughter's been doing a bunch, eh? Man. Okay, I have to. Uh, I want to give away another coin, but I have nothing at my desk. So give me a second. I'll be right back. Hold on. Another giveaway. Away here. He goes. Hold on. Don't go away. <laughs> He's going to look for that 1936 dot cent. Heck. You got one of those. He should be well retired. <laughs> There's only what five in existence, something like that. Something like that, four or five. It's just it's crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Closest I came to owning a dot thirty six was I bought myself one of those stupid Bradford Exchange watches, and it came with a, a, a watch face. It was a dot thirty six. Never wore it. I wore it once to my my coin club, uh, coin club, and uh, got showed it off. Oh yeah, oh, big deal. It's Bradford. Yeah. Anyway, uh, guy comes along. And he says, "I've got twenty two ancient coins that I want to get rid of." Anybody want to trade? And I offered him the bloody watch, and I got all those ancient coins off him. I think I got the better deal. It was probably a replica cent anyway. If it was oh, embedded on a watch. Well, tell it's it was the whole watch face, eh? Yeah, it was definitely replica. Roman, the dot is on a nineteen thirty six Canadian cent. It's a called a dot cent. It's very rare. I'll post a link to it. Um Let me see. The latest one sold for $253,000. <laughs> for a penny. Yep. Unreal. Isn't that crazy? Yep. Then again, too, you know, it's it's part of the game. I mean, it's whatever people are willing to pay and, and rarity and, uh, you know, uh, well, whether they're key dates or not, but uh, grade all counts. That's true. Okay, what did I miss here? You, We, we were talking about trading uh, a dot 36 for a uh, uh, 1967 dime. Are you interested? Uh, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> you want my 1960s? No, I'm not giving away my dime. <laughs> no. So I, I was looking for my Kennedy half dollars to give away. I couldn't find them, but. Uh, 64s? I got some. Ah, these are nice. To, I'll give away one of these on the next one. I've never heard of the uh, referred to as a close or far dot, Ramon. The dot is, is down below 
uh, you, you sent them the link, didn't you, Mike? Yeah, it's a tiny little dot below, between the nine and the three, below the nine and the three. It's just the yeah. smallest little dot. But it's, Aussie's action, where was the auction? Was that Heritage or Sotheby's? What, which one was it? The it's one house. of the big auction houses. It's in that link. The you day my iPad died. Yeah, David, I understand. Y'all know what that is, right? Yeah. Uh, I, I think I have a links to that coin. I only have like five or six of those left because I've given them all away. You, you're just so generous, buddy. <laughs> Isn't that nice? Yeah, the, actually, the dot was supposed to appear on the 1937s, but uh, it was, some were put it on the 36 by mistake. And the ones that were uh, minted at the Royal Committee and Mint reportedly made 678,823 of them with a dot, but they were ordered melted because they weren't supposed to be on the 1936s, but some made it out. Gee, I wonder how they made it out, huh? <laughs> Do you ever wonder about that, how those mint workers managed to sneak those out of there? Right. Aussie Alchemist. No, that is not a Canadian half dollar. That is a okay, Canadian he... quarter from 1967. Oh, I was, remember that year well. It was... Um, okay, it says the most recent sale of a dot cent appears to be April 18th, uh, April 18th, 2013 by Heritage, one of the examples of the Carus collection where graded Mint State 63 red PCGS Sold for $246,750. Yeah. For a penny. For a penny. Is my stream coming in pretty clear, everybody? Let me know. Yeah, yes. it's coming in fine. <clears throat> nice and clear? Okay, good. Is that a bobcat? That a is lynx. a lynx. lynx. Bobcat. Bobcat, same thing. Yeah. When we hit the top of the hour for two hours on the stream here. Isn't there a dot under his tail? <laughs> There's many dots. <laughs> yeah, many dots under his tail. Nice yeah. There, Mike. Good. Yeah. That. That's a good one. I like that. Mike. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we'll get, we'll get. that's what says that's one of his favorite coins. Yeah. I'm. I'm actually hoping to find more of these in the future. Coin roll hunting. In fact, I want to let you guys know something. I went through a full box, $500 worth of Canadian quarters. I did not find one painted, no silver, no commemorative, nothing. Were these bank wrapped rolls there? Oh, no, they weren't. No, they're customer wrapped rolls. Customer wrapped oh, rolls. That's, that that the, uh, that came from a collector. They, they're getting rid of their junk. <laughs> I found nothing because oh, yeah. I wasn't feeling well. I thought, you know, what am I going to be doing for the next three four days? Well, I'll just go through these rolls. If I find anything, I'll make a video on it. I found nothing at all, and that's the first time ever. That I found nothing. I was like, I was in shock. I'm like, oh my god, not even a. Uh, um, there was nothing. There was nothing in it. Unbelievable. See, as a numismatist, my my ultimate dream was to be able to uh, time travel back to sixty five. Can I come with you? Oh, can you imagine coin roll hunt? Just grab the the rolls and put them in in a in a. A safe spot and and look look it up uh, 40, 50 years later. Oh, no kidding. Oh. oh, George, you sent them to me? Yeah, nice. You know what? I think that bo that box that I did was searched. Absolutely. Yeah, it had to have been. Yeah, had, had to not been. getting anything out of it? Come on. Yeah, yeah that's not right. 
So what I'm going to do is bring it back to my main bank. And I actually made my my daughter made a bank account at another bank. Yeah. That's what I'm going to be doing. Yeah. Hey, might as well. I and tried then, to get a box of coins, but they still say that there's a coin shortage. I'm like, no, there's not. There's no coin Thank you. Shortage. My wife came down for a second here. She's People have become so taking you out to the shed. Coins. No, she did not keep me out of the shed. No, <laughs> uh, she she brought me a little something down. Nice. Yeah. You go to any supermarket these days, and and there's hardly anybody that's that's got uh, fiat currency of any type. It's almost all all cards. I'm shocked to see how many. Uh, in fact, I I tried to pay with money, and they the girl looked at me like she was a. I had typhoid or something. She didn't want your cash. Yeah, I don't want to touch. She put on her. She put on freaking disposable gloves to have the money. Wow. I'm like, whew, okay. Yeah, whatever. They hey, let the we got forty one likes. Nice, everybody. Thank you so much for the likes. But yeah. Um, yeah, I, I want to do a coin roll hunt tonight, but um, that didn't happen. So, hey, we're just talking and giving away everything. So. No, I've never done a coin roll hunt. I should do one hey. of those one of these days. Hey, if you do, let me know, and hey, we can, maybe we can do it together. Oh, that'd be fun. Want. Sure. If you want, we can figure out the time and everything. Hey, yeah. yeah. When I was a kid, like in 78, 79, I had a paper route and I was doing all kinds of stuff, you know, to, to make money as a kid. And I would go to the bank and I would, uh, and I was also a coin collector too. So I would go to the bank and I would, uh, I was doing coin roll hunting back then in, in the late seventies. And there was so much silver still in circulation. It was unbelievable. I mean, I'd get quarter rolls and I'd just pick out the, the silvers and then replace them with another roll. And I'd just keep going and then I'd get dime rolls and I'd hit every teller in the bank. I'd just spend all day there during, you know, and I'd just get all their silver. And then it, nice. it came to the point where the tellers were like, uh, what are you, what are you looking for? I'm like, just silver coins. She goes, I can pull them out and save them for you. If you want me to, I was even better. Whoa. Did you keep them? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. When I was, when I, when I was 18 and I joined the army, I had a safe deposit box. That was about, uh, uh almost, little over half full of just loose silver coins wow. that's halves quarters dimes nice. and a few war nickels but uh <laughs> that's awesome. and then i had that safe deposit box for many years and then i um and then when the silver went up really high uh gosh when was that um, I know it went really high during the Carter administration. It went super high. I sold some of the silver then. And uh, this other guy, he was like, uh, he owned a record store. And he was like, hey, uh, I'll tell you what, man, I'll, I'll trade you this Wurlitzer jukebox for your coin collection. And I was thinking to myself, okay, I'll do it. Because it was a real Wurlitzer um, jukebox, you know, with the bubbles and everything and still loaded with 45s. And, uh, and he goes, no, no, I was just kidding. I, I don't want to do it. I was like, why not, man? Because I was really excited. I said, to get my brother over here with his pickup truck. And we'll take this sucker off your hands right now. And I'll bring my coin collection in. I'll give it to you. <laughs> but I had I had some pretty good. I think it would have been a fair trade. <laughs> I'm, just look, I'm just reading the chat here. Ramon says, I have a tube of cents from. 1920 to 2012. I think there's four tools. So I'm gonna have a no one hand. Nice, right on. Save them. Save them all. Yeah, angels. Uh, the 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 coronavirus seems to have settled down a little bit across Canada. Here, it's really low numbers here in Alberta too. Oh, here in Ontario too, eh? They're opening everything back up. Thank God. Thank goodness. Yeah. I think more people died from the vaccine than they have from the actual virus. Okay. Um I want to I want to try to do a duck race everybody. Ooh, a duck race, cool. Um but I need everybody to post something in the chat because when I pull up participants, um there's only like five or six people there. 
and there's 14 people watching so hey, hey there you go um yeah post something um so you can get it on it i'm, I'm gonna give it a, a couple minutes it's 10 o'clock on the top of the hour here i only wanted to come on for uh, a couple hours i'm showing 12 1 2 3 4 yeah, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna let it go for a little bit so everybody can get it because yeah. there's 13 watching and there's 12 participants so somebody's just leaping at the wheel. There we go. I see. There you go. Now. There's 13. Everybody's here. If you're lurking or listening, please uh, get in on it. <clears throat> Hold on a second here. I'm gonna just mute myself for a second. Yes, the I'm going ducky, to. You're the I'm, one. I'm going to attempt a duck race. I've got, already got it loaded up and everything. Um, but no, I just gotta. Figure, I gotta remember how to do this. I've only done that like four or five times. All right. Um, yeah, I just recently got this uh, Logitech. Um, headphone with a boom mic and every time I go I forget that the boom mic is there and I keep hitting it with my hands <laughs> oh that's what I want to get eh? a boom mic I, I saw one I at Walmart before it dies and I'm not hooked up to my computer that's okay Patrick we got you rubber ducky you're the one. Oh, oh I think George is uh, coming in late on that. I don't know if I should add him or not. Hmm. There you go. Okay, everybody. Let me get, give me um, a minute here. Or so, Let's see if I. Oh, oh, crud! How do you do these duck races, George? Man. George, I need you to come up for a minute. Is George coming back up or uh, let me know. Um, if I, I'm going to keep my name in there. So this, if, if somebody else, if, if I win this, um, a second place winner will, will get it. Okay. All right. Um, okay. Let me figure out how to. Uh, Clay thirty seven. Hello. How how are you? We will. Okay. Damn it! How do I do this here again? Um, share. I think you look uh, up Duck Race Randomizer or something. Sure. Or game generator or something like that. Window. Oh no, I don't. I don't think I can do this. Um, what's going on here? Hmm. Oh, Chrome there it is. You go to online-stopwatch.com/duck-race. Oh, there we go. I got it. Hey, Dimeback Darren. Darren, you want to help me out? <laughs> I'm not good at this stuff. Oh man! Okay, now the, now that everybody's coming in here, all these new people. Um, crud. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. There we uh, go. Got a lot of participants now. Mm hmm. What from the swim pool? Yeah, I know. I know you can't do it from the swim pool. Wait a minute! You're in the swim pool. A swimming pool. I'm jealous. All right. Um, Jim Lee Craig, good to see you. Thank you for coming in. All right. I'm going to have to all right, hold on here. Let me do this again. Go over here. Oh, crud. 
This is where I lose the chat because I'm doing too much at one time. No, we got you. All right. I'm going to copy everybody again. Whoa. Too much. Whoa. Whoa. Hold on. Oh, my. Thanks, Mike. Appreciate You're it. You're welcome. <laughs> All right. I, I'm going to clear this list. I'm going to add this here and do this. Um, if you, Mike, if you see anybody new come in, let me know. Okay. Um, I need to, like, um, take out this, like, new member stuff. Shoot. Uh, oh, and what? And you, you're a new member too. What the heck? What did you guys do it to me? Okay. And then go done. And go here. And go here. Oh, budget building stacker. He, I don't think you're in there. Uh oh. Okay, how do you go back here and do edit list? Okay. Yeah, you're there, budget bill and stuff. Okay. I'm going to read off the names here. Mike, if you can help me out, because I can't see both at the same time. Okay. I'm going to read these names off here. Angels, we are nursery. Good. Uh, Arpen One, BC Treasure Tales, budget bill and stack, Clay 37, David Carlisle. Dime back Darren Lowe, found a berry, Jim Lacari, you, Mike, Middleton, North Carolina, Mudswat, Ozzy Alchemist, Penny Pincher, Peter Bose, Ramon One, Sky Quest, 2K8, and it's Maniac. Is there anybody uh, did, did, did get their name down in there? Let me know. And I am going to uh, give you guys like uh, 20, 30 seconds to do it. So uh, that's that's it. So we can get this on the way. Oh, Clay. Yeah, I didn't see Clay up there, did I? I didn't see him either. Oh, yeah. He's there. Okay. okay. So that, oh, yeah. is, Clay 37. that is done. Sorry, yeah. That is done. Okay. So, um, oh, shh. Nikes. You know what? I guess we're going to do a 10 second race, everybody. 10 seconds? Wow. <laughs> yeah, because um, I. Um, unless I can go back here and go. Let's do one minute. Yeah. Um, hold on here. Let me, um, set. Nope. Uh, go back. Trying to uh, figure out how to. Do, oh, there we go. Okay, I got it here. Trial and error. Sorry, everybody. There we go. All right. Now I just have to figure out how to go. Go. Um, that start right next to the clock. Yep. All right. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. We're off and running. It's like Ozzy's out in front. There you go, Aaron Arpan pulls ahead. Here comes Budget Bully and Stacker. All right. Good luck, everybody. <laughs> I got it done. Oh boy, yes. look at Pinchers coming up. BC Treasure Trails goes way out there. He just and here comes again. Found It Buried. Doctor Found It Buried. Angels, we are nurseries coming up too. It's anybody's race. Penny Pinchers gonna, trying. Here comes the mud swat. All right, who are we at here? Um, ain't, oh, Ramon Juan we, pulls ahead for a brief moment there. I got to mute the ducks. Okay, you don't like the Peter <laughs> Bulls. <laughs> there we go. Sky Quest coming up from the back. BC Treasure Tales there. 
Clay, 37. I don't think those ducks got muted. I can still hear them in my ear. That's all right. It's not good. Penny Pitcher coming up as the Alchemist. Mud Sweat, Jim and Curry, the luckiest man on YouTube, it is right behind. Dying back, Darren Lowe is coming up there, but who knows what's going to happen. Bunch of bullets stacker. Look at the Clay 37 coming up from the back. Holy shnikes. Oh, boy, here we go. <laughs> the Zoom Maniac is just like lurking in the background. Penny Pitcher, Ozzy Alchemist there. He wants to get some Canadian Penny silver. Penny Pitcher's moving up, moving up the ranks. Number 14, Penny Pitcher, just not there, but so close. Sky Quest is coming up, yeah, too. It's anybody's, anybody's race. <laughs> Here comes Nick Molnar. I better not win. <laughs> My duck wins. That's it. I'm turning him into duck soup. That's okay. If I win, final 15 second place, seconds. Yes. Four, Who's it going to be? Ramon Juan is in the lead. What's going to happen? Wait. Here, oh, boy. Here he comes to save the day. Here comes Alchemist. Alchemist. Alchemist oh, is going to do it. Yes. There it is. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, <laughs> Ozzy Alchemist. That is awesome. Very cool. All right. Awesome. We're going to be sending some Canadian silver overseas. Nice. Yeah, right on. Okay. Let's remove that duck there. Congratulations, Ozzy Alchemist, with the win. All right. That duck's still going. <laughs> I'm gonna shut that. Duck it's got off. a lot of energy. No crap! Congratulations, Ozzy. I uh, saw so, Ozzy Alchemist. Email me nickmolnor38 gmail.com. If you can do it tonight, that would be awesome. If not, do it in the next day or so. Um, I want to get everything out next week. So yeah. <laughs> Shut the <that> duck up. <laughs> That's called the mute button. Shut the duck up. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> That's a nice way of saying it on YouTube. Rant. Yeah. What? Rant, rant. The penguin. Yeah, there you go. The penguin. <laughs> rant, rant. That's awesome. Very cool. Nice coin. Uh, there you go. That uh, that cougar. Then that that's a um, that's an eighty percent or two. Eighty percent silver cougar coming to you, Ozzy. I think this is the first time you won on my channel too. I, I do believe. So um, I don't have your mailing information. So. Um, Please send it to me. And um, because you're uh, across the pond there, um, it's probably going to take a month or so to get to you. Right. <laughs> yeah. Um, you so know what's I'm gonna funny, though, is I sent a postcard. Actually, I sent a Christmas card, and I mailed them on the same day. I think I sent uh, I sent one to you, and I sent one to Found It Buried, and to... Um, Liz over at uh, Digging Canuck, yep. and I sent a card to uh, a guy over in Scotland, and the guy in Scotland got it about four weeks before you guys got yours. Yeah, sometimes it's weird that way, eh? Yeah, I've, no I've noticed, I've seen that happen. I've sent stuff to Dale UK, uh, Coin, Coin World UK, and um, he's gone in like seven days. Well, people in the states it hasn't gotten in like um, two or three weeks, which is kind of um, kind of crazy. Yeah, I don't have much faith in the U.S. postal system anymore. <laughs> well, that's gonna gonna come to you, and I'm gonna give you some um, some other stickers as well, Ozzy. Yeah, the first awesome Canadian star. That's <laughs> awesome. Right on. That's awesome. <clears throat> Good point to have, too. It truly is. Um, 
you know what the way i shift stuff um customs won't even check it because um i have some tricks tape it down inside of a greeting card something like that you'll he'll see i uh i'll probably get away with shipping that to you for like uh under three dollars so I'll just send you a penny that's wrapped in a big duct tape ball. No, that's not good either. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> but there we go. Right on. Don't want it to break. I've sent stuff all over the world in the last, like, 25 years because I, I, I ship all the time all over the place with sports cards and everything like that. And I tell you... um. I've gotten away with a lot of stuff where I shouldn't have been. Hey, everybody. Let's say hello there. Do a face reveal and a big fat myself. Whatever. <laughs> have you heard anything from Rose Dragon lately? No, I haven't, actually. It's like she dropped off the face of the earth. Well, hopefully she's doing okay. Yeah, I hope so too. Yeah, it's yeah, it's yeah, it's been months actually. Yep. What are we at here? Ten thirty? Oh no, quarter after twenty after ten. Yeah. Hey, Lisa. Yeah. Good to see you. I gave you a shout out there, Lisa. Yeah, Lisa you gave away one of your cards. I gave yeah. Let me see if I can grab it here again. Oh, geez. Let's see if I can get up here again. Oh. That's from Lisa there. She sent me a few extras, so I gave one away tonight. And probably a couple more in the future as well. You know that Lisa's here. I can tell again that uh, I gave one to my boss at work. I said, here's a free ticket. And he looked at it. <laughs> he laughed, put it in his pocket, and walked away. <laughs> so I'm guessing um, who's, who's on tonight we, we, that we can do a raid? Anybody on tonight? Um, uh, don't know. Let me check. We got can can on. We got scrapping order and taking fun. You know what? We should do a can can raid. Want to do can can? That sounds good. Yeah, he's good. Me, uh, I'm gonna get, get. I'm gonna get his link here. Hold on a second. Uh, do that. Do that. Because I am just about done for the night, everybody. I want to thank you, everybody, for coming in. I do appreciate you all. Please hit that like button, everybody. And everybody that has won tonight and who has been gifted something tonight, give it to Carlisle. I have your I information. I have Cody's Cody Adams. If you're still here in the chat, please send me your information again. And Ozzy Alchemist, um, you're you're the first time winner in my channel, and this beautiful 1967 Cougar coin is going to you over the pond there that which is awesome that is really awesome that's the first time i think i don't think oh i sent something over the, no i don't think i've ever sent anything over that way ever yeah no i don't think i have which is even cooler like my coins and our canadian coins my sticker and my postcards are going to be around the world which is awesome. I love that. That's that is, is amazing. But yeah. I have the link there. And yeah, everybody. Oh. What has oh I gotta do I just want to catch up here in the chat before I leave everybody. Hey, everybody, if you haven't left a like on this video, please do. 44 likes. 44, baby, that's me, as uh, the Hoover Boys would say. 
But uh, yeah, if we can get it to 45 on the night, that'd be awesome. I want to thank everybody for coming in. I want yeah, to thank do you, everybody, for helping Canadian Relic Recon reach the 100 milestone. Yes, that is, yeah, thank you. Yes, thank you for hitting that. And now, yeah. oh, are you are you going live, George? Later. Hold on here. We might have to do do a double raid. I wasn't, sure, I wasn't sure if George was going on tonight or not. Yes, Ozzy, please please do that. Um, I still hear ducks. We can do we we can do a double raid. There you go. <laughs> raid can can collectibles over there. Tell them Nick Molnar sent you over there. Give him a little raid. Give him a thumbs up and all that in between. And um, when found found a berry, George is going to be going live in about uh, an hour or so. Yeah, be sure to be sure to check him out over there. Hey, George, yeah. pop your pop your link in the chat there. But uh, for for now, let's uh, let's go raid can can. There you go. Let's and do just, that. Let's do it like a Nick Molnar raid. Yeah, he'd love that. He helped me out there. Sent me a few things. That's awesome of him too. And he I, he he's closing on on his one uh, K as well. So hey, everybody, be sure to check him out. And on that note, thank you again, Mike, so much. Oh no problem. Anytime, brother. You rock. You know, I, I'm, I'm going to return the favor to you. <laughs> Next time, we'll get up there and we will shoot the... Mm -mm. Shoot the moon. Yeah, shoot the moon. Exactly. Yeah, there you go. Absolutely. <laughs> Paint the town red. Paint the town red. Oh, no. That's another story. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's that's, what, that's, that's for adult. another day, right? That's an adult stream. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> Ramon won. Jim DeCarly found it buried. Angel Weir Nursery. CW says, Ah, oh, Z Alchemist. And who else is lurking in the background that I can't see? Put something <laughs> in the chat. Please do. Lisa Przaski, Penny Pincher, and Ramon, and every. Yeah. There we go. Mud Swat. Thank you so much. All my moderators and everybody else. CW Silver Searcher. Thank you everybody for coming in tonight participating and watching out for me we didn't get nailed by a bunch of bots tonight which is awesome until the next video everybody thank you for watching and we'll see you then sky quest thank you so much bye everybody all right bye bye Have a great night, Clay. Thank you, everybody, for coming in. Appreciate you all. Stay safe. Cheers from Ontario, Canada.